Being a Wildcat doesn't mean you just show up to school every day. Oh no, it's more than that. A true Wildcat is all about engaging in athletics and many other activities around school. It's about getting involved and being more than just a student. Because as long as you are on this campus, you are valued. Being a part of all of that is why. Would you please stand and join me for the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. Thank you. You may be seated. Good morning, Wildcats. I'm Cameron. And I'm Megan, and we're here with your morning news. There are media club meetings each Tuesday after school at 2.30, and Stuco is pre-selling t-shirts at both lunches for $20. And now for a commercial break. Man, I'm hungry. You got anything? Yeah. Please. Hot and spicy goldfish? I want one. Here you go. Hey man, where'd you get those? Oh, these? I got them at the Cove. Theater will be performing their newest production, Frankenstein. It will be on Friday, November 6th at 6 p.m. and Saturday, November 7th at 1 p.m. Tickets are at the door for $5 for students and teachers and $10 for adults. Please don't bring children eight and under because it is intended for mature audiences. It's pretty spooky. Jostin's final visit to our campus will be on Tuesday, November 17th and Wednesday, November 18th from 10.30 a.m. to 12.05 p.m. in the cafeteria. To avoid waiting in a long line, girls are encouraged to place their orders on Tuesday, November 17th and boys place their orders on Wednesday, November 18th. This will be your last opportunity to meet with the Jostin's representative to place your graduation order. Now let's get the weather from Devin, but first, a public service announcement. One person can make a difference. What are you going to do today? What's up Wildcats? I'm your new weatherman Devin. Let's hop into some weather. Today we'll have the high of 72 and the low of 49. Let's see the rest of the week. The rest of the week will look in the high 70 ranges and the lows of the 50 ranges. All right, now let's hop it back to your main anchors. Thank you, guys. This week, HOSA is helping with the animals in disaster. You can show your support by donating pet supplies and or food. You can drop them off to Mr. Miller's room 912. Let's go to a commercial break and then get the sports from Ty and Aldo. Hello, I'm Ethan Deliva, and I have a tiny mic. Go to the cameraman. Young man, you're the kind of person who uses flash drives often. Correct? Yes. Now, are they expensive? Usually. Now, what if I told you that the coast sells flash drives? Eight gigs, ten dollars. I'll be pretty elated. Elated, people. I don't know what that means, but he's elated. It's like, do we get, do I get paid for this? No, no. It's signed a contract. No, no, no. Just okay. okay. legal documents, people. Look it up. Hey other Wildcats, I'm Ty. And I'm Aldo, and let's serve up some news. We want to congratulate anyone who made the freshman and JV and varsity basketball team. Also, good luck to anyone who tried out for the soccer team. We wish you the best of luck. By the way, on November 25th, Swim and Dive will have an all-day inventational, so be sure to go support your Wildcats. Of course, the Will Canyon Spirit Line will be competing to defend their AIA state championship title at a qualifying competition so Saturday. November 14th, the top 10 teams in each division will move on to the finals in January. Join the team at GCU and cheer them on. Join the Spirit Line and their pancake breakfast from 8 to 10 a.m. on December 5th at the Surprise Applebee's. Each $7 ticket includes an all-you-can-eat pancakes, pancakes, <laughs> bacon, coffee, and juice. We here at WCTV want to apologize for being late on this one, but here are your student athletes from the month of September to October. 
Preston Spies, winner for the boys golf, and Sarah Kading uh, for September, uh, the winner of volleyball. We also want to congratulate Elise Dempsey, October winner, cross country. Austin Rhea, October winner, swim team. We want to apologize if we pronounced any of your names wrong. Now let's hand it over to the main anchors. And that's all the news we have for you today. And have a great Dice Art Day.